Hey guys, welcome to Outdoors Addiction. My name is Jesse, bringing you guys a quick video here on how I like to fish with chicken livers. It's it's rare that I like to fish with chicken livers, but it's a, it's a good old classic catfish bait. And uh, the way I do it, either you can use these, you can buy these online, or you can simply go to like a Bass Pro Shops, uh, a, any bait store, um, well, I shouldn't say any bait store. Not every bait store carries them, but you'll always find them on eBay. You can probably find them on Amazon and websites like like that. Um, I got these at Bass Pro. I think I paid like three bucks. You get three bucks, and uh, I forget how many come in a package. Uh, right there says four by four squares, fifty pieces, and this is excellent, guys. It's excellent when using chicken livers you know how hard it is when you use chicken livers and i don't like to use uh treble hooks i think if you're not gonna keep the fish to eat um it just destroys their mouth man i don't know if you guys have ever experienced that where you catch a fish with the treble i use treble hooks for uh i used to for my dip baits the fiber baits and all that that i used to until i seen how it destroyed a catfish's mouth that i didn't intend to keep and I kept it anyway, and so I ate it, but it just destroyed the crap out of its mouth. And ever since then, I I don't use treble hooks. Now this over here is a combination with the spawn net here. This is a elastic threading that you use when you, like I, I take this, put the bait in there and grab all four corners and twist it as like a, just twist it like a knot sort of, and then just take some of this and wind that thing up and since it's uh elastic thread you can just pop it off and break it off and it works fairly well uh, i did i use circle hooks for this stuff and it, and it works great i mean you don't have to go out and buy this stuff you can you simply use uh females or women's pantyhose and you can go to the the sewing section at walmart and buy thread it's not elastic but it does somewhat of the same job and I thought I'll just bring that, guys. I mean, I put garlic powder in my in my chicken liver, give it up for a better smell. I don't know what you guys do, but that's what I do when I'm fishing with chicken liver. Take a dash of that, put some in there, shake it around. But this stuff's great, man. I, I mean, I don't leave home without it when fishing with chicken livers. It's actually great to fish with the your fiber baits and your dip baits and stuff if you don't want to get it all over your hands or if you want to use a circle hook or a J hook or whatever hooks you're using besides a besides a treble I don't like trebles man because I don't want to I don't I'm not out here to hurt the fish or anything like that I want to catch and release most of the time and there's times where I do keep them to um, feed myself and feed my family because they also like fish but this is just a quick little video guys on what I use when I'm catfishing out here mostly for channels um so that's about it guys i think i'm out here fishing but i'm not catching anything it's kind of chilly out here but i'll talk to you guys later all right guys until next time keep fishing tight lines guys peace